going on everybody let's talk about your seven day market update in the las vegas valley uh real estate market so we're going to jump right into it today so over the last seven days i was very curious to see what this number would look like so you had listed properties these are properties that came back on the market these are properties that were fresh coming on the market there are a total of 2106 2106 folks when i was looking at these numbers what i found these are almost i want to say identical but very close and very similar to what the numbers were during the winter time if you're watching us during the november coming up into december so during that time period we didn't freak out like the bottom of the floor was falling out it was simply slower numbers and if you look back at previous videos and previous data you will see that these numbers are very comparable so things are still pretty good in the real estate market 2106 on the market last seven days from today so let's look at contracts contracts 941 now yes they're a little bit less than what they were during the winter time but at the same time, 941. So we're almost half and half. So as far as we have over 2,000 listings going on, we have almost 1,000 that are going into contract. Deals are still being done. I've had conversations with people multiple times this week, and they're like, you mean people are still buying homes? The answer is yes. Is it being done differently? 100% it's done differently. There's precautions, there's extra steps. What does that mean? It takes more time, just like anything out there. If you add steps, it's going to take longer. But business is still being done, 100%. Proof's in the pudding. The numbers are right here, folks. Now, what about lease contracts? Lease contracts, we had 374 properties go into lease contracts. I was very curious about this. I'm like, what are lease numbers going to look like? We're pretty close to across the board throughout the year, about 500 per week. We were 500 last week. Yes, took a little bit down. A lot of that market, we see people coming into the city, moving to the city, staying in a lease for the next year. I'm like, okay, what are people going to do? Are they going to gravitate, move towards leases over the next couple months? So people aren't really doing that either. They're a little bit down, I would say, due to traveling, people coming in and making uh, Vegas a pick for the next year. 372, there's still lease contracts out there moving. So if you have a rental out there and you're like, nobody's gonna get into it, I recommend 100% keep that door open right now because they're still doing lease contracts, almost 400 of them this week. And then we take a look at coming soon properties. Coming soon status, that's 47. Those are very comparable to winter numbers. We're normally about 50, 60 during the winter. So they're almost the same as well. So yeah, coming soon, this is stuff that hasn't hit like totally available on the MLS. This is something actually right now, I talk about all the time. It's a great opportunity to take advantage and advertise your property, not ding you on days. So as far as the coming soon status right now is actually a really good idea. Say, hey, I'm not showing it right now, but I'm gonna be listing this property. It's gonna be available, for example, um, end of April. Um, it's going to be available at the end of April. Hey, this is a property I have upcoming, you know, 123 Bryce Street, whatever it is. You can price it wherever you want to, test the market a little bit, see what the feel is. So by all means, I mean, I even myself, I'm watching the numbers day by day because nobody can predict it. And I tell everybody that. I'm like, nobody can predict this because nobody's been in it. So I'm analyzing the numbers every single day. And I'm like, these are very comparable to what we were looking at in September and October. Or I'm sorry, I apologize, more into October and November. So you have 2106. I mean, it's not different. Last week we seen a spike. It was over almost up to 2500. So I was like, oh man, this is a frenzy. People are going to go crazy. This is going to make some adjustments into our market if this continues. And I said it last week. Let's see what it looks like next week. No. Some people are in panic mode. That happens, completely understand. Others, we stayed about the same, 2106. Contracts, 941. We're still doing almost 1,000 contracts across the valley. So if you're considering selling your house, it's not a pitch right now. I'm just telling you because these are the numbers 
almost a thousand contracts. People are still buying homes. People are still going into contracts. So if it's something you're considering, don't eliminate your plan. Maybe there's a detour. Okay. Take the detour. It might be a little bit slower with some extra steps, but people are buying homes. So lease contracts, once again, 374. People are still leasing properties and coming soon, just over 40 or 47. So folks, there's still movement coming on is what it comes down to. This is not a pitch for you on Mondays. This is simply how we help you, how we assist you, how we get you that information is strictly by data. These are the real numbers. I say it all the time and I'll say it again. Do not get the information from the guy that does your washing down at the cleaners. Do not get your information from somebody that cuts the grass. Do not get it from somebody that just watches the news and says, oh, this is why I heard blah, blah, blah. These are actual real numbers that are being produced across our valley through the MLS so you can see it firsthand what is actually going on. This is real information. So then I hope this is helpful, educate you on your next steps, what you wanna do. You're always welcome to reach out if you have general questions, a plan, whatever it might be. This is strictly informative when I do these on Mondays. This is your seven day market update, Johnny Richardson. Hope everybody's having a great day. Nice and safe, of course, out there. So um, to what I hear, I didn't check it as far as Las Vegas, got an A plus on social distancing. So keep it up, everybody's doing a good job. Let's stay positive, we do have that extra 30 days, but stay positive, folks. Let's rock and roll, keep doing our thing, love up on our families, inform yourself with good information and good content out there. Hope you're having an amazing day and can't wait to see you soon. See you later.